if you think about all the things you do when you're procrastinating, some of them actually involve hard work. You might have cleaned up your room. Um, you might have you know, spent a lot of time surfing the internet and learning things while you're putting off your homework. Um, so you're not avoiding effort. What you're avoiding is the unpleasant emotions associated with a particular task. Um, sometimes that's fear or anxiety. Uh, you're afraid you're not going to be able to master it or it's too hard. Um, in other cases, it's boredom. Um, you just really don't like it or it's extremely repetitive. Um, and in many cases, it's confusion. Um, you're stuck or you're not sure where to go. And so you, you'll do anything to postpone it. And I think the problem, obviously, with those negative emotions is that they make us uncomfortable, whether you're afraid or bored or confused. Um, and avoiding that, that discomfort means you actually limit your own growth. So a huge part of the value of seeking discomfort is that you embrace those negative emotions, you push through the boredom, um, you let the anxiety in, and then you try to manage it. And that ultimately allows you to propel yourself forward.